Hi everyone, I'm Khan from Samsung Research. It is great to present you with our work titled End-to-end -end Single Frame Image Signal Processing for High Dynamic Range Scenes. I will start by introducing the problem domain and then the proposed method. Later, experimental results will be explained followed by a conclusion. The goal of our work is to generate a high quality picture on the right from the input on the left. But it is challenging because of the mixtures of shadows and highlights in one picture and noise and artifacts in captured by array. For this problem, HDI imaging, either with customized hardware or multi-frame merging, may generate high quality output but is costly for mobile phones. One can apply inverse con mapping and low light image enhancement to the area picture, but ISP artifacts in area picture might remain. The whole ISP can be learned like PyNet or CameraNet. However, either unfaithful color may be generated or both clean colors and color sRGB need to be available. As in the left figure, our method takes input of bioarrays regarding labels of multiple frames merged pictures. Our network architecture on the right figure has main blocks of brightness enhancement and color processing. Brightness enhancement is to enhance the detail of shadows without saturating the highlights. We learn increment in stops of exposure for each cell to flexibly deal with fine detail shadows and highlights. We further improve by learning multiple stops for each cell and mixing them together. Besides, the color of each picture is related to camera settings at the capturing time, represented in color correction and white balance matrix. Therefore, we incorporate these two matrices into our network. We push it to forward by generating multiple sRGB candidates and mixing them later by a CNN network. We trained our network with different losses in either low or high frequency. The pixel intensity is re regulated by exposure and brightness losses in frequency low frequency domain, while PCL detail is learned by enhancement loss in hypocrisy domain. We add adversarial loss to pursue the realness of the output. We trained our network with a HDR plus dataset which has then more than 3000 pictures. The curated set of 153 pictures are used for testing. Our, math, our network has about 12 million parameters and the inference time is about 15 seconds for a 12K picture. Objectively, compared to the related work in this table, we outperformed them in common image quality assessment metrics, such as PSNR and SSIM. Subjectively, related work may not enhance the shadow in bioarray denoising LDR or suffer from annoying noise in low light enhancement and inverse tone mapping or force color in end-to-end -end ISP of PyNet. Contrarily, our network brightens shadows and generates rich details and sharp edge. So in summary, we postpone an end-to-end -end ISP for high dynamic range since with normal network architecture and loss design, where the performance is confirmed in comparison to rated group. Thanks for listening.